The title of this is Ghetto Police Escorting Residents for Deportation. Henrik Ross buried his negatives and his prints in the ground because he didn't believe that he was going to survive, but wanted to be sure to record the tragedy that he and the other Polish Jews had lived through. He was able to retrieve his photographs because he was miraculously one of the almost 900 survivors. However, the negatives were damaged. And we see here the damage, we see cracking. It almost looks like flames. And that is an important parallel and very symbolic for the content of the photographs. Here we have two officers shown leading these residents who are all carrying their belongings. Presumably they don't know that they're being led to their death. And if we look at the faces, there's all ages here, and we see a young boy looking sort of pensively out into the open, whether he can see the photographer or not, we don't know. But we wonder, what is he thinking? What does he understand? And we really think about what does it mean for us today to look at a photograph like this and know what happened after. So the powerful image here of these officers bringing people out to their death is heart-wrenching to see today, but a reminder of what the camera can do. It can record tragedy, it can record history, and it can also be used as a weapon and an act of resistance, as Henrik Ross used it.